my name is Brian Mattis. I'm the director of process engineering at GenXCom. GenXCom uses RF and photonics to create interference cancellation systems. These enable full duplex communication in wired and wireless applications. So what this means is that signals can now transmit and receive at the same frequency at the same time, rather than taking turns like they do in traditional wired and wireless applications. So why this matters? What this does for us is enables higher throughput for both wired and wireless. So in the real world, those with home internet using through cable infrastructure, one that would receive faster home internet uh, with higher download and upload speeds. And in the wireless space, this allows for better towers in 4G and 5G, enabling to them to have higher range, higher throughput, and better band utilization. So it basically makes them better in every possible way for, for wireless communication. What that means for us is, uh, besides just using it on your cell phone, going forward, there's a lot of other applications that require a robust, high throughput network, things like autonomous vehicles or Internet of Things devices. All these things are, need this network to happen, and the network just isn't there yet. So with us, when our technology, we bring it to fruition, we're really gonna help, uh, help the rollout, rollout of 5G. NSF phase one, it enabled us to make our first round prototype devices. And they were successful and we were able to deploy them, but due to their size and speed, they really only fit for certain niche markets and they were in the cable space. Uh, what we're gonna do with our NSF phase two is be able to build a chip that is the next generation chip for us. And this, this photonic chip will be roughly 10 times faster one eighth the size and one sixth the power. All that combines allows us to penetrate a lot other, a lot of other markets, uh, especially in the wired space, especially in the home use space, um, and eventually into the handset space. So allows us to propagate this technology way out uh, away from the infrastructure side and into the commercial and home user side. Others trying to do this interference cancellation in this space only use radio frequency devices, but they're very limited in bandwidth, and so. It's really a marriage of two very different technologies. We're the only ones playing with photonics in this space combined with RF. And what that does is just to use this photonic device to mimic the echoes that come off uh, when a when transmit signal goes out into the world. So by doing that, we can cancel out a lot of that interference and background noise. To explain full duplex a little bit more, uh, some applications being you can't hear and, and talk at the same time on your cell phone, or if you're home internet, you get a faster download speed than upload speed. With full duplex, you can transmit and receive at the same time over the same frequency. So suddenly your download speeds and upload speeds are equally better than they were before. 